So when I was struggling a lot with my gut health, I post this photo all the time. This is my gut health transformation. It's not a fat loss transformation. I was always bloated after every one of my meals and I didn't understand why. So I was frustrated and I started doing research so I could learn more about how to improve my gut health so that I didn't feel bloated anymore. I was getting discouraged by my own results because I thought, man, I just need to lose belly fat, I just need to lose belly fat. But in reality, I was just so inflamed and so bloated. So I started researching and I learned a couple things that I want to share with you. This is what I started doing to improve my gut health. So we have bacteria in our gut, we have good bacteria, and we have bad bacteria. We always want to have more good bacteria in our gut versus bad bacteria. You'll hear things like people saying they have SIBO and all of these gut health diets to help bring down the SIBO bacteria, like all these things that you hear online. Well, that's because we want to make sure we have more good gut bacteria. And how we do that is by having more probiotics in our diet. Probiotic rich foods are things like um, kimchi, kombucha, and uh, yogurt. So you wanna have this in large amounts in your diet, right? Just having one serving here or there is not gonna cut it. The second thing is digestive enzymes. Now those enzymes is what helps our bodies break down the foods that we're eating. If we're not able to break down the foods that we're eating efficiently, it's going to sit in our gut, it's gonna ferment, and we're gonna bloat. So foods that are high in digestive enzymes are things like mango, pineapple, and papaya. Now again, it's not enough just to have one serving of this. We wanna have multiple servings in a day. Now, when I was in a calorie deficit, it was really hard for me to get those fruits in my diet because this bowl right here is 20 grams of carbs. Now, if I wanna get enough digestive enzymes coming just from whole foods, I can easily blow out like 60, 80, even 100 grams of carbs just in fruit. Yes, it's gonna help me with my gut health, but it's not gonna help me with my fat loss goals. And because I was on a weight loss journey at the same time that I was trying to help my gut, I had to be really mindful of the types of foods that I was eating and I just couldn't afford to spend 100 grams of carbs on these fruits and all of these foods that were high in probiotics. So what I found instead was a greens powder that gives me all of that, helps cover my bases and it's low carb. It's only like three grams of carbs, I think three or five grams of carbs. And I drink that every single day anyways. No, I'm not on a fat loss journey right now, but I still take my greens because even though I have the carbs, to add fruit in my diet and all that stuff. It's just not the reality of my situation. I don't have enough papaya in my diet. I don't have enough pineapple or mango in my diet. And I definitely don't eat kimchi, sauerkraut, and kombucha and yogurt every single day in order to cover those bases. So on top of this, I take two scoops of greens every morning and my gut health has never been better. So if you are on a weight loss journey and you are also trying to improve your gut health, here are two things that you can do. You can start adding in probiotic rich foods and digestive enzyme rich foods into your diet consistently every single day so that you can see an improvement in your gut. But if you're also trying to be mindful of your carb consumption and you want an easier, more convenient option, I'm gonna link the greens that I use every single day right here for you. It's gonna take you directly to the website. This has those probiotics, the digestive enzymes that your body needs in order to break down the foods that you're eating so that you can improve your gut health. All of my clients love this. I've been taking this since 2017 religiously. It tastes absolutely amazing. The key here is ice cold water. If you have any questions on gut health or the greens or anything at all, my DMs are always open to you girls. I hope you have an awesome Monday.